Hallo und herzlich willkommen zurück zu The Walking Dead. Wir waren hier in der letzten Folge. Machen wir mal weiter. Spielen Episode 2. Genau, wir gehen weiter. Ah, doch mein Headset jetzt ganz kaputt gegangen. Das Gute, jetzt habe ich. Ich nehme mal mit den schlechten Kopfhörern auf. Die sind echt scheiße. Weil die drücken so aufs Kiefer. Die sind. Ah, meine anderen waren wie schöner. Erstmal eine Jammerfolge draus machen und einen Kaffee trinken. Ich hoffe, ihr hört das Schlafen. Kaffee muss man genießen. So, jetzt sind wir hier im Ladescreen. Ja, wir müssen jetzt das leider noch mal von vorne machen. Aber ist ja egal. St. John Family Dairy. Da kann ich ein bisschen reden. Ich, ich meine, vielleicht sind sie wirklich freundlich. Aber ich bin, wenn man sich zumindest mal die Filme anguckt aus den USA, also mit Zombies und so, wo so eine Farm war, zwei Leute und so eine Mama, also eine Mutter, klischeehaft sind das eigentlich immer sehr kranke Leute. Ich weiß nicht. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. Wirklich, also wollen wie die aussieht. Das ist mir unang, das ist mir sehr 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 unheimlich. Weil alte Klischees sagen, dass das diese Farm immer irgendwelche kranke Sachen machen, wenn so eine Hölle ausbricht, dann ist so eine Farm mit zwei Söhnen. Ähm vier. Und wie gesagt, da bin ich ein bisschen misstrauisch. Does that offer apply to the rest of us? We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she... We have a vet, but we could bring her here. Uh -huh. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered. Maybe our whole group could come for the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend, and I'll prepare some dinner—a big feast for all you hungry souls. Hmm. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Und diese Typen sind mir auch ziemlich unheimlich, auch, auch so wie die gehen. Und round up everyone for the trip over here. Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. Abwarten. Ich will ja nicht so ein miese Peter sein. Kumpel, mag glaube ich, bist du, ne? Mag heißt du. Aber, wie gesagt, also dieses Klischeehafte aus den... They're offering us food. We should do whatever we can to make these people like us. Wie gesagt, the way Brenda was talking, I get the feeling like she'd be happy to have us. Wenn man ganz schön anguckt, jedes Mal, wo so eine Farm war, mit mindestens zwei oder einen Sohn und eine Mutter wie hier, ist immer was Schlimmes passiert. Immer. Mich würde es auch nicht wundern, wenn hier irgendwas Krankes ab. Vielleicht sammeln sie ja Zombies und so und fressen die. Es kann ja auch sein, dass diese Sachen gar nicht. Oh, was ist das denn? Oh, eine Schaukel? Da wird sich aber Clementine trotzdem drüber freuen. <lacht> oh, aber kaputt. 
I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. Mind if I fix it? Sure, that'd be great. Mama sure does appreciate y'all helping out. Looks sure. like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Ja, okay, das letzte ist eher nebensächlich. Also müssen wir sowas suchen. Wir haben eine Axt, aber kein Seil. So, was haben wir denn hier? Kann er da rein? Ja, klappt wohl mal. Hi there, Lee. What can I do for you, sweetie? Can I help you with anything around the house? I think with Danny's help, I've got things pretty well squared away in the kitchen. But feel free to check with Andy. He's got a lot of weight on his shoulders these days, so I'm sure he'd love any help he can get. Your family's done an amazing job of keeping this place up. Well, now aren't you sweet? Thank you, Lee. The boys and I have tried to adapt as best we can, but we still keep some of our old routines to help remind us of better times. What happened to the rest of your staff? Oh, we've had our share of tragedy here, just like everyone else, I'm sure. Some of our staff took off to find their family as soon as they heard the news. The few that stuck around, well, we lost most of them the first night, those... Things showed up here. It was a tough night. Well, if anything comes up that I can help with, feel free to let me know. <sighs> Lee, I sure appreciate it. No problem. No problem. Ja, wie gesagt, ich finde es eigentlich ziemlich. Hmm. Die Arbeiter sind. Oh, da haben wir also mal ein Seil gefunden. Wir dürfen uns ja bedienen, weil wir brauchen ja, wir klauen ja nicht. Wenn wir uns fragen, was wir, warum wir das Seil nehmen, was This haben wir denn hier? Huh? Das Haus war mein Vaters Leben. Es bedeutet alles zu ihm. Du weißt, als er das erste Mal dieses Haus kaufte, war es ein single-storey Haus. Ist das richtig? After us kids was born, he insisted on adding a second floor. Said they had to have room for as many babies as they could have. <laughs> Mama, she was done after Dan. My folks stopped after two as well. Then one day, the world changed. Now this place is all we have left of Daddy. That's why we take such good care of it, and why we want to share it with good folks like yourselves. Vielleicht bin ich auch einfach zu misstrauisch. Vielleicht bin ich wirklich. Mm, fresh herbs. I can hardly wait for dinner. Ja, so vielleicht stimmt das ja auch. Aha, was haben wir denn hier? Windspiel, das kenne ich. Used to have these on the front porch of my house growing up. Hope the noise doesn't attract any unwanted guests. Ach, Quatsch. Nehmen wir einen Stromzaun. So, das heißt, wir gehen mal hier wieder. Äh, genau, runter. Treppe runter. Ah, da haben wir auch ein Brett, was wir brauchen. <lacht> this is too big right now, but if I can find something to cut it down to size, this might make a good seat for the swing. Hmm. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. Na, ah, man, fragt er höflich. Wir haben auch ein Seil genommen für die Schaukel, keine Angst. Ja, das Brett ist perfekt. Und steckst du dir in den Arsch rein. <lacht> Erinnert mich so an Spooky und das Thermometer bei Traumschiff Surprise. Das hat er sich ja auch reingesteckt. So, wir gehen jetzt mal die Schaukel hier. Ha? Benutzen wir das Schaukel ansehen. Nee, benutzen. So. Alright, this shouldn't be too tough. 
I'll be damned. Mama's gonna be thrilled to see that old swing all fixed up. Hopefully our kids will like it too. Did you say something, darling? Oh my goodness. Did you do that? Just trying to help out a bit around here. You know, I used to push Andy and his brother out here on that swing every night when they were kids. Seems like such a long time ago now. Yeah, it does. Yeah, can I get out of here? Nö, so ja, schade. <lacht> ja, ich, wär, ich hätte auch geschaukelt. Mach ich auch mal bei Sims 2. <lacht> so. Wonder how much food they've got in there. Hopefully we'll find out. Ja. Hm. Ui. Man, this fence is fantastic. We'll do whatever you want to help keep it running. Well, clearing that perimeter is going to be a big help. Just let me know when you're ready. Ja, hier sind wir soweit. Ich habe mich, glaube ich, soweit ein bisschen umgesehen. Oder nein, 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 warte. Den Generator will ich mir noch angucken. Generator. You guys come along with gas just in time. Hey, uh, don't mess with that, okay? The thing's a little tricky and I don't want to spend half a day trying to fix it again. Okay. Sorry. Hi. Hi. Wir haben doch gerade geredet. You guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. Been stockpiling, huh? Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, you can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll never come to that, but thanks. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. These generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and... We gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. Yeah. Like us. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. That gives doch einfach keinen Sinn. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. But that's a kind of sense. Why? Geht man weiter, wenn man dann Ort findet. Warum? Auf der Erde bricht die Hölle aus. Do you think we're doing enough to get the St. John's to like us? Well, we don't want to seem over anxious. Showing them we can handle this fence is going to go a long way. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. Why the hell did you have to tell him I thought he was a racist? As if tensions weren't high enough. Sorry, man. It just it popped out. We'll work it out somehow. Well, hopefully he'll calm down once he's out here. Yeah. There's one. I didn't fight. No, okay. Ugh. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Ja, hoffentlich sonst kriegen wir nämlich eine geballert. Das tut weh. Wir hätten uns jetzt den Pfeil noch schnappen Looks können. Like stuck. Gut, das kann er also noch. Disgusting. Gut. So, kann er ihn jetzt? Achso, jetzt. Der hängt... Okay. Bam. Bam. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. 
Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Uh, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas, easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. What do you mean by that? 